And I'm awake again. It's warm outside now, and I didn't even get cold that night. Now I will need to finish my homework and therefore head off to school. I think my mom's still asleep. I need to finish this quietly without waking her up. Oh, I really love math. It's my favorite subject in school. The calculations are mesmerizing. What time is it? Oh no, I'm late for school. I can't fail this test. I need to pack up and run to class as soon as possible. And most importantly, don't forget the prep notebook. Hopefully I can repeat this before class. Time to run to school. What? Why is mom crying? She's really upset about something. How can I help her? That's right. I'll try to talk to her. Mom, what's wrong with you? Why are you crying? Oh, hello, my dear son. The fact is that we have almost no money left at all and we have nothing to pay for the house. I'd hate to lose this house. Wait, I'm doing really well in school. I'll get my paycheck soon and we can pay for everything. You think that's enough for us? Of course, we can even do a little remodeling in this room. Oh, that's really great. I would love for that to happen. Now get to school before you're late. Oh yeah, you're right. I almost forgot I might be late for today's test. JJ, thank you so much for all you do for me. No problem, mom. I'm happy when I can help you. It's important to me too. Oh, oh, I'm gonna be so late. I gotta run to school. I've got all the way across the village to get there. Do you help your parents? Is it morning already? Oh, right. It's the first day of a new school. I can't oversleep. I wonder if I'd be interested there. Will I be able to make new friends? I have to go wash up and then ask to find my dad. Hopefully he's still home. And I'm telling you, I don't want stock in your burger joint. I don't think they can generate revenue for me. You're just a fledgling startup and I'd rather buy a Disney park. And you don't have to talk me into it. All the best to you. Good morning, Dad. It's my first day at my new school. Can you take me to school and give me money? I can't be late. Oh, Mikey, hi. I'll call you back. Yeah, sure, I'll give you the money. Let me just find where I keep my cash. Oh, there it is. Here you go, son. I hope you have enough for today. I'm sorry, but I've got work to do. I've got a lot of things to do since we moved in. Your driver will take you away. Make sure you make friends with someone at school. Make lots of friends and do well in class. And now I'm working. Thank you, Dad. Okay, I understand. I'll do my best. Okay. Well, I should probably get going so I'm not late on my first day. Good work, then. I'll see you tonight. Dad has been working so much lately. We hardly see each other. But he does everything he can to make sure we have a good life. Greetings, Mr. Mikey. Ready to go to school? Yeah, sure. I've got nowhere else to be, as long as we're not late. Don't worry, we'll get you there in a breeze. Just be careful. I don't want to have an accident. Here I am at school. I'm even a little glad I'm here today because I have to learn and get smart to make a lot of money. There's kind of a test today. I'm sure I'll be able to write it perfectly. I'm very smart. Wow, there's a beautiful classmate. How wonderful she looks. I must have a chat with her. But I'm a little scared. I'm not sure she likes me. Maybe offer to help her with the test? Yeah, I think that's the only way she'll look at me. Hey, wait, please, don't go. Yeah, okay, so what's up? What's wrong, JJ? I'd like to offer you an interesting deal. Today, I'll help you with writing your test, and afterwards we'll go for a walk. What do you think of the plan? Uh, okay, JJ. We'll see what my mark is, and then we'll decide. While I can't just go along with it, you can figure it out for yourself. Okay, I'm sure you'll write well, so get ready to go for a walk afterward. I'm glad such a hottie agreed to go at least that way with me through a favorable offer. I'm very happy with the way things turned out. Now it's time to go to class and figure out how to discreetly me to help her. Wait, what's that sound in there? Wow, what a cool car to come here. I wonder who it is. I've never seen it. Apparently it's some new guy. Thanks for driving me. Here's your money. Wow, that's a lot of money. He's giving it to the driver so calmly. Although if he's coming in a car like that, he's got a lot of money. It's an interesting school. It's quite big and looks nice. I think I'll be fine studying here. I was right. It really is his first time here. Maybe offer to help and get to know each other? He doesn't know where our classroom is. Hey, wait. Hello. You're new here, right? Uh, yeah. Hi. I'm trying to find out where we go to school. My name is JJ. I've been studying here for a long time. I can show you where we study. That would be great because I don't have any friends here and I don't know anything at all. My name's Mikey, by the way. Great. We have a generally ordinary school, although it's quite large. Yeah, I can see that. I like it all. 
Where exactly are we studying? I'll show you everything now. If you don't have any more questions, we can go to our classroom. Yeah, sure, let's go. We'll start school soon. Then let's not waste any time and let's go already. Our place is right here. Yeah, okay, I'll be right there. You go ahead, JJ. Well, you have to follow me. I'm showing you everything. This is where our lockers are. And this is where we put all of our unneeded textbooks. I see, it's convenient. Yeah, especially since it's right next to our classroom. Let's get in there and see what's inside. All in all, we have an ordinary classroom. Nothing interesting here. And where are you sitting? You can sit here with me. I'm sitting alone anyway. Okay, great. Thank you for that. Our teacher is late as usual. It's no surprise if anything. I've already realized that, but that's even better. I'm glad about that. It's true. That's why I never rush to class. Hello, everybody. Class. Sorry I'm late. I had my reasons, but we have a new kid in the class. Only I don't see where exactly he sat. I'm here, teacher. I sat down with JJ. Yeah, that's right. I see you. Our new kid, Mikey, comes from a rich family. His dad has been a great supporter of our school financially. Wow. Seriously, are you that rich? Yes, JJ, that's right. All right. I guess you'll get to meet him. But for now, let's learn. That's awesome, Mikey. Your dad's a great guy. Yes, How cool. True. We have a rich guy in our class. I'm happy about that. Enough talking. Let's do something useful. Let me see what we have planned. The teacher should not have told about you in such words. A classmate has already spotted you. I can see that, JJ, but that's okay. She's kind of cool. Yeah, she's not a bad girl. But it's still weird that she started looking at you like that right away. Guys, I totally forgot. We have a knowledge test today. It won't be easy. Those who have been preparing will write a great paper. I'm sure of it. Oh, no. I think I have a little problem. Three hours later. Oh, my goodness. I'm so happy happy to have the best grade ever. I didn't study for this test for nothing. Now, I'm getting closer and closer to making a lot of money. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and give me a like if you believe I can do it. Now I can happily go home. I'm gonna tell my mom the good news. Oh my god, why is Mikey walking around so upset? Did he get a bad grade? Hey Mikey, what are you so upset about? Bad writing? Yeah, JJ, I didn't study for that test at all and I got the worst grade. Yeah, Mikey, I can see that. This is bad. How did you write it, JJ? I wrote for a better grade. I mean, I've been studying. Good for you, JJ. And I don't understand it at all. Don't worry, Mikey. I can help you prepare and you'll write better. We're friends now. Thank you so much, JJ. I'm so glad you're so kind and smart. Of course we're friends. I'm happy about that, too. Then we can go out right now and I'll explain it to you. Yes, it's true. We can go to my house and sit together there. Great, but I'm a little hungry. Don't worry. You can definitely find something to eat at my house. Awesome. Thank you so much. Hey, Mikey, you want to go for a walk together? I'd really like to go with such a cool and rich guy. Is that right? Do you like me? Sure, Mikey. I hope you think I'm very pretty, too, because I have such a great figure and such a pretty face. Wow, it's true. I really like you, too. You have money, right? You're not going to offend me with this? Of course not. Look how many I have. I don't feel sorry for any of it at all. You're so cool and awesome, Mikey. Let's get out of here, just the two of us. Of course we will, beautiful. So what's going on here? Uh, wait, what about me? Weren't we supposed to go together, too? What? Did you really have a deal? Well, actually, yeah. Get out of here, Scarecrow. There's been a change of plans, and you're not in them. I'm sorry, JJ. Let's meet some other time. And my rich guy and I are going on a vacation together. Bye, JJ. See you tomorrow. Jesus. Mikey traded me for this classmate who's only going with him because of his money. That's a little hurtful. I don't understand how Mikey doesn't see this and why he thinks she's so great. I don't think she's good. Jesus, Mikey. What's wrong with you? Oh, no. What happened in there? What happened to Mikey? What am I supposed to do? I have to find out what really got in there. Please, somebody help me. JJ, come here. Oh, my God. What happened? Mikey slipped, and now he's not moving or responding. Oh, no. Apparently, he passed out from the hard blow. What are we supposed to do now? He could have been hit very hard. I don't know. I guess we have to wait for him to come to his senses. And if he doesn't, he could just die here, JJ. We can't just stand here and wait. Okay, I agree with you. Then we should call an ambulance. I don't know first aid. Well, they're not coming anytime soon, and he needs help now. Jesus, what are we supposed to do then? Suggest it. I don't know. I don't have any ideas. I guess Mikey's just gonna lie here unconscious. No one else will ever help him. Wait, stop being upset. I'm taking him to our nurse right now. She can definitely help Mikey. This is our only chance to help him now. Then you need to do it soon. There's no time to waste. God, he's so heavy for his height. Are you gonna help me or not? No, I'm afraid. I'm not going in there. Carry him yourself faster. But when you go out with him for money, you're the first to go. It's so hard to do that, but that's okay. I have an obligation to help my friend. 
moments later. I've already carried my friend and it looks like he's going to be fine. Now I'm going to go in there and make sure of it for certain. Or maybe I should wait a little while the nurse helps him. Just need to know if I can get in, that's all. What am I stupid? Hey, can I come in? Yes, you can. That's great. How are you guys doing? I see Mikey's okay. Yes, because he bumped, he immediately lost consciousness. But because you brought him in quickly, it was no big deal. Great, I'm very glad I was able to help and all is well. Thank you so much, JJ, you're awesome. It's true, you did a great job. There's no problem with that. I did what I had to do. I want to thank you, JJ. I hope this helps you. You deserve to get this much money. Jesus, Mikey, you shouldn't have done that. No, you saved my life. Money is nothing compared to that. Thank you. Wow, where do you get all that money you're giving away for nothing? Well, actually, it's for a reason. That's not the point. I can see that money is not a problem for you. I just come from a rich family and I don't feel sorry for them. That's cool. Don't you want to spend time with a pretty girl like that? Is that right? You're not kidding? Of course not. I'm really looking forward to spending time with such a great guy. That's nice to hear from such a beautiful girl. We can go from here and you'll look at me more often. I agree. I'm getting tired of being in this school. Then let's go somewhere where no one will bother us. I really want to see your gorgeous figure again. I don't mind, but I want to get some money first. Sure, don't worry. Money is no problem. That's great. Then we'll both have a good time. Are you guys really gonna walk out of here alone right now? Yeah, JJ. So what? No, it's okay. I'll go home too then. Great. Then I'll see you tomorrow. I need you to help me with the test. Bye, JJ. Thanks for saving Mikey. It's true. He's a great friend. Let's get out of here already. Of course, handsome. I'm coming for you. Jesus, Mikey found himself another girl who followed him for money. But okay. He lives his life the way he wants. I'm very grateful to him for helping me with the money. Now I'm gonna go home and show my mom that money. I think it might make her happy. And that will help us survive a lot. I'm almost to our house. I already can't wait for my mom's reaction to me giving her such a big wad of money. I really don't want my mom to worry about this, and hopefully this much money will make her happy. God, I still don't have enough money. How can I live now? I'm getting really tired of this whole thing. Hey, mom, hi. Stop being sad. I've got some very good news for you. Sorry, JJ. I guess your news can't cheer me up anyway. Look how little money we have left. Well, here's my good news. I helped a new boy at school, and he gave me such a big wad of money. Can you believe it? Jesus, JJ, I hope you're not kidding. How much money is this? Take everything I have and make it count. I think it's quite enough to last. I can't believe my eyes, JJ. That's really a lot. Yeah, Mom, I know. And I also got the best grade in the class, and I can make even more money soon. I'm very proud of you, JJ. I'm very lucky to have a son like you. I'm going to go pay all the debts, JJ, and buy us groceries. Okay, Mom, thank you so much for saying that. You deserve those words, son. You really lifted my spirits a lot. You're the best. I'm very happy about that. Come home soon, Mom. It's a good thing I helped Mikey, and he helped me. I hope we can have a new life now. Later. Mikey and I went outside for a walk because we're bored of sitting at home. Hey, all you guys. We're trying to find something interesting to do because it's impossible to play on the computer. Impossible not because someone forbids us, but because we're sick of it. Yeah, that's right. Oh, JJ, look what the ambulance is doing here. Oh my God, something must have happened. We need to offer help. I'm on my way over there. Oh, there's been a misunderstanding. So you're just filling up the car? Yeah, guys, of course. Nothing's wrong, don't worry. But I'm so glad you saw the car and ran to help. Of course we can't do it any other way, especially with such a beautiful nurse here. Wow, really? You're not kidding? No, of course not. What kind of jokes are we talking about? Just look into my eyes and see how I look at you. That's very sweetly said. I'm glad to hear such words from such a handsome boy. Maybe then you won't insult me and give me your phone number, and I'll be sure to call you. I probably won't even think about it because I love the idea. That's great. I'll be sure to call you when I get home, beautiful nurse. Okay, I'm just finishing work soon and wouldn't mind spending time together. That's great. Don't think I'm not the kind of guy who just forgets you. I really liked you. You can prove it to me later. In the meantime, you go about your business, and I'll go about mine. All right, see you, beautiful. Wow, JJ, how lucky you are. I'm really glad you were able to get her number. It's true, Mikey. I've never met such beautiful girls. I'm shocked she liked me right away. I will really look forward to meeting her. Hopefully, it will be soon. Let's go for a little more walk, then, so you can spend some quality time with her later. Sure, Mikey, but let's go in the direction of the house, or I'm afraid I won't see her. No problem, man. I get it, and I'm glad you're so lucky. Thank you so much, Mikey. I'm glad I have a friend like you. It's nice to hear that. Hey, man, please wait. What? Who
Who else is there? I saw the cutest guy in this village and couldn't pass by. How are you doing? And which one of us are you saying this to? Of course you are, handsome. I saw you walk by and I knew you were the one for me. How can you even question it? Is there anyone else beautiful here? Well, actually, I'm with a friend and he's quite handsome too. Okay, maybe that's true. But you're the one I fell in love with as soon as I saw you. Don't you want to tell me the same thing? What exactly do you want to hear? Did you like me? Do you want to go out with me? Honestly, no. Sorry. I already have the one I love. Are you seriously talking about this right now? He's telling the truth, but I really like you. Do you want to start dating me? We'll go in pairs, the four of us. I've never heard such rejections in my life. See who else you'll love. What? Well, I apologized and my friend was sympathetic to you. We'll see exactly who you apologize to and who you love later. God, she's weird, isn't she? She's talking in riddles and she didn't even answer you. Forget about her. All witches are a little weird. They have potions going on in their heads. That's a funny thing to say. Okay, let's go home. I have to call my nurse soon. Sure, JJ, no problem. Awesome. Three hours later. It's been a long time. I think my hottie is done working and I can call her. I'm a little worried. I don't want to seem stupid or pushy. I want everything to go well and I want to date this beautiful nurse. Okay, stop worrying. I'll just call and ask to meet up. Especially since she said herself that she liked me. Okay, I'm waiting. I really hope she answers. Who's calling? Hello? Hi, this is JJ who met you on the street today and asked for your number. Hey JJ, I'm glad you called me. I hope you're free by now and can find time to meet me. I'm still at work, but I'll be free pretty soon, so we can meet up somewhere. How about we eat at a restaurant and get to know each other better? I'd love to, JJ. Then an hour from now would be good for you? Yeah, JJ, I'll see you there in an hour. Great, I'd love to meet you. God, I'm so happy about this. She's very pleasant. I shouldn't have been worried at all. Now, I'm gonna get ready and I'm gonna meet my dream girl in an hour. The main thing is to continue to be normal and not act like a fool. Only I don't know what's best to wear, but I have time. That's good. I'm already at the restaurant and have ordered some very tasty dishes and am waiting for my nurse to get here. Hopefully it will come very soon and not have time for things to cool down. But overall, the place and the atmosphere here is great. And I really like it here. Ooh, there's my pretty girl here. JJ, you're already here. Yes, beautiful. I've already ordered all the entrees and have been waiting for you. I'm glad you're here. How wonderful you are, JJ. I'm in awe. Hurry up to plant and let's start eating while everything is still warm. You picked a great place and picked great food. Thank you so much for such a surprise. I really want you to be comfortable with me and have a memorable night. I think with company like that, I'll definitely remember this date. I'm very happy to hear that. Then let's eat a little and socialize and get to know each other. I agree, JJ. Because I really hope that you and I don't just see each other once and go our separate ways, but stay for a long time. Wow, very beautifully said. Bon appetit to you, beautiful. Thank you so much. Enjoy your appetite, too. Oh, my Do God. Like and JJ everything? seriously I turned me down meal? and picked this nurse? This really hurts like. me, and I don't, don't see worry, how I'm JJ, any worse than her. Delicious. I definitely I won't just leave it at anything. that. And I will but do anything to have this handsome boy with me. I hate to see this. JJ is no match for that nurse at all. She's so ordinary compared to me. But I'm a witch for a reason. I know what I have to do to get him with me. After that, he'll come crawling back to me and talk about love for days and nights. What a pleasure it was to eat and walk with you, JJ. And I'm so glad we fit each other so well. Unfortunately, it's getting dark pretty soon, and I have to make it home in time. Wait, why would you go anywhere? Why don't you come over to my place and spend the night? Because I'm afraid you won't make it home in time anyway, and it will be dark already. Yes, JJ, you're right. The sun is already too low. I'd love to stay at your place. I'm really excited about this. We'll have time to spend more time and enjoy each other. Because I really don't want to let you go. That's really nice, JJ. All the more reason I'm excited excited to see the inside of your house. I think you'll be comfortable and convenient here, don't worry. Yeah, JJ, I can see how beautiful it is in here. I'm glad you're enjoying this. I'm almost finished with my potion that will help me get my JJ, and I'm sure it will work 100%. I know what I'm doing. I am very angry with this nurse, and I want JJ to forget her forever and love only me. That's it. My potion is completely ready. I did it on purpose so that the potion looks like water. JJ will definitely not be able to tell the difference and will accidentally drink it. Now all that's left to do is bring it to his house neatly. I can handle it for sure. So I came to his house, and he's already sleeping with that nurse. God, that's so disgusting. 
but that's okay. Let her enjoy it while she can. Soon JJ will run away from her to me. All he has to do is drink it. I'm purposely putting this here so he won't pass it by and accept it as plain water. All I have to do is wait until morning and open the door to JJ looking at me with loving eyes. But now I have to run away before anyone sees me. The next day. Oh my God, who's ringing the doorbell this early? And so loud and so often, they're going to wake up my beautiful girl. Good thing she didn't wake up as abruptly as I did. I have to run and open the door before she wakes up because it's too early for her to get up. Stop ringing the doorbell, I'm coming. Hey, JJ, hello, let's go for a walk soon. No, Mikey, I can't, I've got my nurse sleeping. It's too early, but you can come in and we'll wait for her. Seriously? You guys are that serious already? Yeah, we're a couple together now. Hey, JJ, you awake already? Cause I didn't see you in bed. Yes, love. It's just that my friend Mikey came to see me, remember him? Yes, of course, the two of you came up to me in the street. Yeah, that's right. He suggests we go for a walk. The three of us can do it. Okay, just tell me where I can get a drink of water first. Look in the kitchen, it's definitely something there. It's great that you two are together. I'm happy for you. You're a very beautiful couple. Thank you, Mikey. We had a great time last night and I realized she was the one for me. That's really cool. You've needed a girl like that for a long time. Especially one this cool. Yeah, Mikey, I think so too. I'm definitely not letting her go and I'll be with her. I love you. I only want to be with you. What? what? You, you talking, talking to, to me? me? Uh, I guess that's what was said to me after all. I just love her and I want to go there sooner rather than later. What? I don't understand anything. Why did she say her? We need to figure out where she's going to go sooner rather than later. She stopped responding to me or you at all. Something weird happened. We can't lose sight of her, JJ. We need to see where she's going. And I think we can answer all the questions. That's a great idea, Mikey. I really hope it's some kind of joke, but I doubt it very much. Don't worry, we'll figure it out. Hope so. I can't understand what happened to her that she just took off and ran into the swamp. I don't understand it yet either, but I have a hunch. You see this house? I think she's running that way. Yeah, you're right. Let's get over there. We need to find out why she's here and who she loves. She's already knocking on the door. Let's go faster. I'm almost there, Mikey. I'm about to find out what happened to my nurse. She's not responding to me, JJ. Darling, why did you come here? And she's not answering you either. I can't get my head around everything that's going on right now. There you are. Oh my God, what are you three doing here? Holy cow, you're the one who tried to hit on me on the street. What is this nurse doing here? I don't understand. I've come to you, my love. Jesus Christ, no, it wasn't supposed to happen like this. Come to me, sweetheart. And what was that just now? What are they doing in there now? Honestly, I don't get it myself, JJ. Apparently now my girlfriend left me for this witch, although I don't understand what this is all about. They're kind of weird. I agree with you. Why don't we just forget about it and go home and play on the computer? It's a shame to part with the nurse a bit. She was wonderful until she ran to the witch. There are plenty more beautiful girls in the world. And forget the nurse. You agree she's weird. I agree, Mikey. I don't want a girl who just ran out on me. I'm happy for you, JJ. Let the two of them continue to have fun in this house. Yeah, Mikey, the two of us are going to have so much more fun. Meanwhile... Today is the first day after vacation. It is urgent to finish all the tasks to avoid getting a D on the first day. I need to get this done quickly because I have to leave the house soon. But I'm almost done, so there's no point in rushing and hurrying too much. That's it. One last line left to write and I'm all set for today. All that's left is to pack my backpack and I can head off to study at my favorite school. Onward to new knowledge. God, why do I keep counting all this change on the table? It's clear that this money is only enough for the next two days anyway. And what to do next, I don't even know. Things are too bad at this point in my life. So excited to go to school, I've really missed it all. And when I'm in a good mood, it means learning will be easy. Oh, why is my mom sitting sad over there? Hey mom, is something wrong? Why are you sitting there so sad? Our money's really tight, Mikey. I just can't feed you properly. You'll have to walk around and starve because there's only enough money left for your basic needs for two days at the most. And and I have absolutely no idea where to find any money. It's really all very sad, Mom. But you don't have to worry. Things will get better soon. I will graduate soon, and I will get so much money that you will never work again. So don't be sad, and I'll go to school. Thanks, Mikey. Today is my most ordinary day. I don't have anything to do. 
so I'm going to sit down at my powerful computer to play from the very morning. I love those days when there are no plans and I can do whatever I want. Except I don't know what I'd rather play, so I'll play anything I can get my hands on. A great plan, I think. I don't get it, JJ. What are you doing here? I woke up and decided to play on the computer, so what? And the fact that it's your first day at a new school, you don't even care? Quickly turn everything off and get ready. You can't be late. God, I really forgot about it. I thought it was vacation. I'm so sorry. That's okay. Okay. The important thing is that I thought of you and stopped by to see what you were doing. It's true. Thank you so much, Dad. Here's some money for you today. Your driver is waiting for you and ready to take you there. Wonderful. Thank you so much again. You are the best. There is no problem with that. The main thing is to study well and don't be lazy. Yes, of course I won't let you down. Then I'll see you tonight, JJ. Bye, Dad. Love you. Oh, my God. My dad is so great. He's very kind and generous to me. I'm very lucky to have him. I have no right to upset him, so it is my responsibility to do well in my new school. Now it's time to go there. Oh, JJ, hi. I'm your new personal driver. Are you ready to go to school? Yes, of course. I'm very happy to go there. Then let's not waste any time and let's go quickly. Get in the car and let's hit the road. Yes, absolutely. I totally agree with you. How wonderful it is not to be walking on such an early morning, but to be riding in the comfort of a car. Now it's time to go. You want to put on some music while we're driving, JJ? No thanks for the offer, but I like driving in silence better than listening to music. No problem. Your wishes are law to me. Thank you so much. You're a very kind and good person. I'm glad I'm a good fit for you, JJ. Hope we can be friends. It's not a problem. Here I am, almost running to my school. I'm so glad to be here. I missed it all so much. Now the main thing is for me to study well so that I can help my mom out of poverty. I'm the man of the family, and it's my responsibility to make sure my mom and I have a good life. Oh, what's that sound in the back? I'm even a little scared to turn around, but I'm really curious about what's in there. Wow, what a cool car. There's my new school. It looks pretty beautiful, to be honest. Thank you so much for driving me here. Apparently, it's the new kid in our class, and he seems to have a lot of money to come here in such a nice car. I should meet him. I think he's a great guy. As long as he didn't think it was about the money. Hopefully, this school will welcome me and I can do well here. But all in all, I think it will be fine. The main thing is to find friends. JJ, I'll pick you up after school. Okay, thank you very much. Dad has found a great man. I like him a lot. It's nice that the driver treats me like that. Now I'm off to find where I'm having my classes. I think in such a big school, it would be problematic for me to find something on my own. But that's okay. I'll just see what's interesting here. All in all, I love everything about it. The automatics and repairs, awesome. Awesome. Wow, and on this board, you, my viewers, have been left with an important assignment. Be sure to read it and do it. It will be my pleasure. Hey, man, hello. I saw you drive up. Are you new to the school? My name is Mikey. I can help you find your class. Hi, I'm JJ. I don't know anyone here, so I'm really excited to meet you. We can be friends. I don't really have any friends either. What do you think of our school? I really like it here. It is very big and very beautiful. I'm glad you like it here. You don't know where we are studying yet, do you? Yes, of course. It's my first time here, so I don't know anything at all. Then let's get there soon, because being late on the first day is bad. I agree with you. You sound just like my dad. Huh, that's funny. I just got here early with those thoughts in mind. Are we only going to study in the same room? Yes, of course. There's plenty of lockers. Enough for everyone. We're not going anywhere else. That's awesome. I'm really excited about it. Ready to step into your new class? Yeah, sure, Mikey. I'm a little worried, but I'm excited to start learning. This is where you'll be spending most of your time. Very cool, especially since I see you have some very pretty girls in your class. Come sit with me, JJ. I don't have anyone sitting here. That's great. It's a pleasure to sit with you and and especially with such an interesting girl next to me. I'm glad you're glad. We just have to wait for the teacher. It's true. It makes me want to start learning. Hello, everyone. Sorry I'm late. There was traffic on the road. I drove the car myself and don't remember any traffic there. <laughs> I completely forgot. We have a new student in our class. Yes, hello. I'm JJ. This boy comes from a rich family. He has a lot of money. And I am very happy that he is now studying with us. Um, okay, well, thank you so much for that. You said he had a lot of money. Yes, he does. Wow, I didn't think we'd be so lucky. It's really cool to have you in our class. Uh, I'm glad to hear that. If it's okay with you, we can stay here after school and study extra. Okay, why don't we just start learning? It's true, the lesson is already in progress. Sure, you just think about my offer. I don't think I'll disappoint you. Okay, I've memorized your words. I'll definitely think about it. Look at me, JJ. I'd love to spend time with such a handsome guy, too. Okay. 
Okay, what a fun and funky place you have here after all. Okay, JJ must be tired of so much attention. Let's start a new thread. Listen up, because we will be writing a quiz on this topic soon. Finally, after so much talking, we are starting to learn calmly. It's true, because the whole thing was weird. That's true, but actually that teacher is pretty cute. That and a classmate. I really like you, JJ. I'm very lucky to have you in our class. Jesus, she just looks at you and doesn't look away. Yeah, it's a bit weird, I agree, but I'm glad to have such a pretty girl looking at me. Two hours later. Class is over, which means we can go home. Short day today, but that's even better. I need to slowly get into studying. I'm happy about it, too. It's better to learn less now and more later on. So which one of you two is JJ? Uh, I am, so why? Why are you seducing a TV classmate? Have you lost your fear or something? No, this is some kind of misunderstanding. I didn't do anything. She talked to me. So you're blaming her as well? You ask her yourself. What's the controversy? Oh, what are you doing here? As soon as she found out I came from a rich family, she started socializing socializing with me. Why are you slandering her? Are you afraid to admit your mistakes? Jesus, you can have anyone confirm what I'm telling you. I just wanted to hang out with him a little bit. He's new to the class. See, I told you I'm not lying. Calm down, please. It's just that he's rich and liked me a bit and I wanted to socialize. So you were gonna trade me for this rich guy? I don't know, to be honest. You're dead, rich boy. Don't! Ouch, what a headache. Where am I now? Apparently it hit me really hard and I was taken to the nurse's station. And it's quite nice here. And the nurse herself looks very nice. Hey, I'm awake, am I okay? I don't have any diseases? No, boy, you're all right. You just got hit hard and lost consciousness. You came to your senses pretty fast. Great, because that psycho wouldn't even listen to me and just hit me. Oh, JJ, you're awake. I'm so glad you're okay. Hey, Mikey, I too am glad nothing bad happened. I'm the one who brought you here, JJ. I was really scared for you. The nurse is pretty cute, and thank you so much for helping me out, Mikey. You're my friend, JJ. I'd never leave you in the lurch. Then let's go home! Wait, stop. You're the new JJ who comes from a rich family, aren't you? Yeah, it's me. It's my first day of school. Oh no, I think it started again. What are you talking about, Mikey? I noticed your beauty right away. Do you have any money on you? Well, yes, of course you can have some. You helped me heal. Wow, JJ, you're really cool. Thank you so much for your kindness. You're welcome. It's not hard for me to thank you. Did you like me? Have you seen what I look like? JJ, we have to hurry up already. We've lost a lot of time with this fight. Yeah, I agree. Let's go, Mikey. Hope to see you again and spend time together. Okay, I'll think about that suggestion. Bye, thanks for your help. You get hit on all the time, JJ. I notice it too, Mikey. And everyone does when they find out I have a lot of money. They're weird, of course. I was supposed to have a driver come to pick me up, but I think he was waiting for me and decided to drive back home. Yeah, JJ, I saw him. You were unconscious for quite a while. Then we'll walk home together now. And in general. It's very strange to see that you're rich and everyone wants to socialize with you. Never mind that. I know my only friend is you. I'm just poor and nobody wants me. You're the only one in this school who doesn't talk to me for money. Hey, JJ, can you come over here for a quick chat? I'll take some time. Just come over here and we'll talk in private. Yes, of course. I'll come to you now. Sorry, Mikey. I won't be gone long. All right, JJ. I'll wait for you out front. I'll find out what she wants from me and I'll come straight to you. I'm here. What did you want to talk to me about? I'm glad, JJ, that you were able to make time for me after that situation. It's okay. I'm listening to you. I wanted to apologize for that boy. I didn't think you'd get hit so hard by him. It's okay. The important thing is that I'm okay and I'm alive and well. Then let's spend some time together, huh, handsome? Oh my God. Mikey's really upset standing there by himself. I unfortunately can't. Can't. I have to go. JJ, I'm so glad you haven't gone home yet. Do you mind staying for extra classes? No, I'm telling you, I have to go home now. Come on, don't you want to spend time with a hottie like me? I really can't. You're not the first person to ask about me. Everyone else is just awful compared to me. What? I actually wanted to spend time with JJ too. I told you I have business. I couldn't spend time with anyone. Hey JJ, I'm so glad you're still in school. Wait for me, I'll be right down. What's the nurse Oh my doing? God, what a terrible thing is myself. happening. JJ, thank you again for the money. Maybe we can spend some time together? You're all here to spend time with me, but I repeat, I am busy. Can't you find time for a hottie like me? Hey you, I've been asking JJ to hang out since the beginning, so get out of here. I want to go with JJ too. You're all unworthy of me. Are you kidding me now? You're not worth my heel. JJ will be mine. I initially started communicating You're all him. horrible and not worth him. God, just stop a making a big nurse. deal out of this. I'm not like going that. anywhere with fish. anyone. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
My god, what did I just see with my own eyes? Now the three of them are lying there beaten. All because everyone wanted to get money from me. They're disgusting. Why all this was necessary, I don't understand. Jesus, JJ. They fought like they were fighting for their lives. How is that even possible? That, Mikey, is how people who only want money behave. It's disgusting. Good thing I'll never act like that and earn everything by my own labor. People behave sometimes worse. There's only three of them here. Some of them are completely absurd. Well, let's go home then. Let's not pay any more attention to them. I agree with you, Mikey. I really appreciate that you are not like them.